our oranges, apples stuck on the on top of each other. Oh. If you remove the bottom sure, one, they sure, all fall. Sure, sure, sure. So dominoes effect means that. Oh yeah. I have IQ sure. of one hundred seventy. <laughs> I see zero 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 but where is all the nine? Welcome to our science lab. Today our third topic is rounding and we have a student. Excuse me, what's your name? Oh. You're not sleep in the classroom. What is your name? Sorry. Uh -huh. Rifat. Alright, oh, Rifat. Uh, what is rounding? Uh, rounding is... Uh, I don't know. Okay. Um, Alright. I don't want to tell you the definition, but um, let's have some, let's have some Socratic dialogue. How many students you have in your school? Exactly two thousand. Exactly two thousand. Are you serious? A uh, little bit less. One thousand nine hundred. One thousand nine hundred. Seriously? Exactly well, one thousand nine hundred. It's not exactly. It's eighteen sixty. Eighteen sixty. You kidding me? Uh, you, uh, you give me th gave me three zero two zero one zero. Well, okay. I'll be. You want me to be hundred percent precise? Yeah, I want to be hundred percent precise. Eighteen sixty three. Eighteen sixty three. Is it 1863 close to 1860 or 1870? Huh. Well, can I put it and see what is linked to? Yeah, sure. Or you easy? can put it, put the marble on the right place. Okay. Oh. Okay. So 1863 is close. so. What would be? What should we round to? 1860. We should round to 1860. 1860. If it is a 1863. If it is a 10th place. 10th place. Okay. Alright, and instead of 10th place, we want to do 100th place. Mm -hmm. Here, instead of 1860, what number should it be? Uh, 18,000? Not 18,000. Try again. Uh, 18 million. 18 million. Well, that means I should probably go higher, right? 1800 too? Oh, 1800 to 1900. That's correct. 1800, 1800 to 1900. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, can you show me on the paper what 1800 to 1900 represents? What does what place? Hundredth place. Hundredth place. Okay, very nice. So, 1863 would be this is 1800, right? Mm -hmm. So, 1863 would be right here. Oh. All right. Now you're gonna have to tell me where do you see. What should we round it to? Should we round it to? Should we round it to eighteen hundred, or should we round it to nineteen hundred? If we round it to hundred place. A few minutes later. Nineteen hundred. Why nineteen hundred? Because it's closer to this side. It's closer to nineteen hundred. Yeah. All right. Okay. Now we're gonna go to. We finish with ten place. We finish with. Mm -hmm. 100 place, now yeah. we're gonna do? 1000. 1000 place. Um, 1863 would be uh, somewhere here. Mm -hmm. So you tell me, should we round to 1000 or should we round to 2000 if we are rounding to 1000 place? We have to round to 2000 if we are rounding 1863 to 1000 place. Why? Because it's this 1863 is closer to 2000. All right, so 10th place, 10th place, 100th place, and 1000th place. So convert 80, 1863 if it is 10th place, 100th place, and 1000th place. Okay, so for 10th place, okay, we found out 1863 becomes 1860. Very good. For 100th place? So for hundredth place, we found out 1863 becomes 1900. For thousand place? And for thousand place, we just found out that 1863 becomes 2000. All right, now I'm going to teach you something. 10 place. 10 place? Yeah. So 
This is the ones place. Okay. This is the tens place. Okay. So I have to round it to the tens what place. Is, what is the target? The what is your target? target? This is how you're gonna do it. You're gonna ten place. You're gonna call it what? Target. Target. So all right. If the number next to the target mm -hmm. is from zero to zero one two three four then you do not change the target target if it is five six seven eight and nine then you have to round up round you have to add one to the target mm. now this time what would be the target is it four or you have to add one so the number next to the target is seven is is seven seven is right here seven is right here so you have to add one so that becomes what five five so then whole oh. 5,000, uh, 52,347 become what? 52,350. All right, now let's do this one. 5,9,6,2,5,5,4. Hmm. Can you round it to 100, please? Okay. Okay, so 100, please. First, First show me target. Uh, no, 1,000, please. 1,000, please. Right? Yeah. So this is ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, please. So, so our target is six. Very good. So now we have to write down all of the numbers to the left of six. Okay, write so, it. Okay. And everything after six just becomes zero. But now we have to decide what the target becomes. Mm. So the target can either stay six or it can add one. All right. So how do you analyze that? So you have to look at the number with the target. To the right to the target, right? Yeah. All right. So this two, you said that if this number next to the target is either zero, one, two, three, or four, we have to keep the target. And two is here. That means we have to keep the target into six. All right, very nice. Now, we're gonna move to the decimal number. Is that okay? Okay. 5.9.236. Hundred. 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 So you round it to hundred. Okay, hundred. So we have to find the hundreds place. So this is one. 10 and 100. No, so, 100. 10th, 100. Oh, 100 and 100 is not the same? No. So this is 10. This is 1. This is 1. This is 10. This is 100. 100. 100. And 100. Oh. <laughs> okay. So 100. Okay. Oh okay. So this is tenth. This is hundredth. <laughs> well, I think you are making up word, but sure. I'm yeah, following. Yeah. So I have to round up to the nearest hundred. So again, I have to look at the number next to the target. Oh, but far no, no. Let me say it again. So this is our target. This is the hundredth, right? Everything before the target go to. It stay the same, right? Mm -hmm. So everything before the target is gonna stay five nine point two. Everything after the target is gonna go to zero. Now we have to find out what the target will become. So is the target zero, one, two, three, or four? If it is one of these numbers, then the target is stay the same. So the target is three, so we're gonna keep it the same oh. no we are not keeping same yeah, 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 because yeah. this is six this is bigger than the number you wrote here oh all right so this is five six seven eight and nine so yeah. this is one of them oh. okay oh so six fall over here right so we actually have to add one to the target right four, four. very so nice five nine point two four zero now comes the hard part this is the last problem it seems like you understand everything but uh 
but that's the typical case everything was easy that's why you probably understood it but this is the last one are you ready i have iq of so, 170. write 1 million 199,999 uh 1 million 999,999 wow very nice okay i'll round it to 10 place 10 place Round it to tens place. Okay, so this is ones place. This is the tens place. Okay, yeah. Okay. Round it to ten place. So this is a joke for me by now. That means we have to add one to our target. So nine plus one will give us ten. So our final answer. You don't have to right. write final answer. This is wrong. There is a domino effect. Domino I don't see any domino here. Uh, this is not domino, dominoes pizza. This is different dominoes. Dominoes effect. You have, have you ever seen dominoes? Sure. One falls, everything falls. Okay. You know, have you ever seen like, you know, uh, the oranges, apples stuck on the, on top of each other? Oh. If you remove the bottom sure, one, they sure, all sure, falls. Sure, sure. So dominoes effect means that. Oh, happens. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, really? I, I didn't realize that. Okay. So you start with the one, the nine, the nine, the nine, the nine, the nine, the nine. So one million nine hundred ninety-nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. So first we have to find target. Target. Target is the tens. Okay. And then three days later, everything after the target is gonna fall over, just like domino. So this nine, we're gonna wait to rest okay so it's just like domino it's been knocked over and the the other nine is also gonna get knocked over it's just like domino <laughs> what, high school, what high school do you go to again oh brooklyn tech ah. is that what the teach at brooklyn tech oh that's what i learned yeah try again that's wrong okay Okay. okay, so first I have to find the target. This is my target. So that's the tens place. Six months later! So now I know oh, how to do this. Brilliant. Instead of nine, this will become ten. But this will become ten, but not just that one. This will also become ten. Likewise, this nine become 10 this line become 10 this line becomes 12 and this line becomes 12 <laughs> thank you thank you thank you okay that's okay that's fine that's fine so 1 million 9099 75 years later all right so this is target and this is true that this is zero but since this is bigger than nine you add one one so nine become zero nine become zero nine become oh ten ten and then carry over oh one then nine become ten carry over one 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 Nine is this nine? Oh, it's one. One become so two. So oh. one million nine hundred ninety nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine become how many million? Two million. So this is called domino effect. Um, now you understand. So that one becomes two. Okay, very good. Now can you tell me what is rounding is? No, well, I can tell you what cheating is. Where is all the nine? <laughs> You are just making up math. What do you mean all oh, those nine? This nine, it has to be somewhere. It's like you... Where, where did this nine went? 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 Where, this, where is all the nine? I see zero, 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 But where is all the nine? No nines. It's like you chop off the nine and only took the first half. Let's just tell you this.
What is this? <laughs> Ten, I'm not a baby. Okay. So if you understand that nine disappeared. Oh, yeah. So nine times 10, because you add it every time, every time you add it one, nine oh. become 10. And one carries over. And this is no longer nine. So that's why all the nine becomes zero. All the nine becomes zero because this is the nine. Mm. And remember the lesson number one, we learn about nine is the max. If you are allowed only one place value, one place value mm. with all the digit, how many digit we have? Nine. We have 10 digit. Oh, we have 10, 10 fingers. 10 what is the maximum number you can uh, write? Nine. If, yeah, nine. If, they, <laughs> they, if they allow two, Place value. What is the maximum number you can write? 99. Oh. Right? Yeah. So now, if you add mm -hmm. 1, then you are forced to go to? The next. Next. Place value. Next place value. Oh. All right. So 1 carries over. And over here, this is no longer the maximum. Mm -hmm. This is no, no, no longer the biggest digit, right? Yeah. This is not the biggest digit. So if you add that becomes two so whose value is bigger this value is little bigger that's why this is the rounding version of one million nine hundred ninety nine thousand nine ninety nine okay thank you now you tell me can you tell me what is the definition of rounding yeah so rounding is the estimation of very good this student had no understanding of rounding at, in the beginning but toward the end uh, with a little bit of frustration he finally understood what is in, in fact he discovered what is rounding in the hands-on school discovery take take takes place thank you for discovering the rounding thank you all right <laughs> uh, I, I smashed my finger between the cars oh, but okay. you can go thank oh. you